Headed to a fun location this summer? In today's video, I'll share with you my tips on how to travel sustainably. My name is Manuela Barron, this is The Girl Gone Green, a channel focused on sustainability and conscious living. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that red subscribe button. Since becoming more eco-conscious, it has been an effort of mine to travel more sustainably. Because according to a study published in Nature Climate Change, about 8% of greenhouse gas emissions come from traveling. So it's important to be mindful when planning your next vacation. The biggest thing you can do is reduce how often you fly. Be mindful with your flights. When I do have to fly, I try to bundle my trips. That means if I have to go somewhere for work, I will try to coordinate the timing so that I can also visit my family, my friends, sustainability, and meet some of you. So that it ends up being this like jam-packed vacation rather than flying multiple times a year for different reasons. Travel whenever possible by land. That means taking the train, finding a bus, or any other form of ground transportation that might be available in your city or where you're going. I recommend checking out a resource called Rome to Rio. I'll link it down below, but it's a good place to kind of find these transportation options. Bring your own toiletries. You can avoid those mini single use wasteful products by bringing your own shampoo bar, tooth tabs, anything that you like to use, bring it with you on vacation and it'll help minimize how much single use plastic you consume while on the go. And don't forget to say no to all the freebies, especially on airplanes. You don't need any more earplugs and you definitely don't need a pair of slippers. Pack your own eco kit. I recommend packing a water bottle. And if you're traveling international, consider packing a water bottle with a filter like this one from Berkey. It will prevent you from buying plastic water bottles and keep you hydrated. I also recommend bringing your own utensils or just bringing a fork so that you can use it instead of the plastic ones that they give out at different cafes and restaurants. You're prepared. And if you have the room, consider packing a lightweight Tupperware container so that you have your own favorite snacks on the go, plastic free. My favorite is asking to get dumplings in my own container from the street vendors. Delicious. Speaking of snacks, don't forget to bring your own for the plane or car ride. Not only is it healthier for you, less expensive, but it will also help you avoid all the plastic packaging. My go-to snack is different nuts and seeds. I also love dates and peanut butter. And if you want, you can bring a full meal in your own Tupperware. I like bringing an aname for a nice protein kick or just bringing whatever salad I want to eat that day. And yes, you can bring your own food and snacks onto airplanes. Just make sure you consume everything before you land in the next country and make sure you're not packing any liquids. I recommend when you're going through TSA to take all of your food and put it in a, in a bin, just like you would your laptop. This helps you from having to then get your, your luggage screened and it just saves you a step. You're welcome. My last tip for you is to pack like a minimalist. Consider developing a capsule wardrobe for your vacation matching different colors and patterns together so you can make different outfits without actually having to pack a huge, heavy suitcase. A little pro tip on this one, I recommend packing natural fibers like cotton because they tend to retain odor less so you can get away with washing your clothes less frequently while on the go. For a full guide on how to green your getaway, check out the hashtag Green Your Getaway campaign and discover how you and your friends can travel sustainably by sharing dosomething.org's sustainable travel guide. You can share it on social media and with your friends and family by visiting dosomething.org slash greenyourgetaway, sponsored by Cotton. Well, happy sustainable travels, my friends. I want to hear from you. What are your tips for having a greener holiday? Let me know down below in the comments. For now, don't forget to live sustainably and consciously, and I will see you in my next video.